what up what up what up my dance babes welcome back to another video with your girl hbcu dance teams if that is something that you are interested in make sure you like this video up throw a comment down below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're new to my channel welcome to the game welcome to the dance team and if you're a returning subscriber you already know what's about to go down Yes, guys i hope everyone is having an awesome day today i hope everyone is having a great week whatever it is right now that you're going through i hope it is great so yes guys so you guys see that title you already know we're about to get into we're going to be talking about a little bit of everything but first we want to get into my girl teneria if you guys don't know teneria first yes for the legs if you guys don't know Teneria, Teneria is a former SU, Southern University, fabulous dancing doll. And you guys may know her from some of these videos that I'm posting here. Or you may see her from McKinley when she was also on that team. So yeah, man, Teneria is one of the best, best dancers I have known from the southern university dancing dolls she wasn't captain but she gave a lot of a lot of energy and a lot of sass so recently shenaria just had a birthday and she turned 25 years old you know some people say 25 25 whatever you want to call it but yeah my girl made a birthday and she had a really really great birthday and she also posted these beautiful pictures of her i love 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 these pictures um i do want to get some of my insight on the pictures i love um the vocal points of it i love what she is giving i really love the black and white like black and white pictures just do everything for me and i feel like more of since she's a dancer and her lines and technique and everything like that, I feel like black and white was definitely a great choice for Teneria to pick for her pictures. And you guys know turning 25 is really like a big milestone in your life, you know, because they have, oh, you turn one years old, you turn five years old. You turn um, 16, you turn 18, 21, and like 25 is one of the biggest birthdays. So since it's one of the biggest birthdays, Saniri decided to throw a big birthday bash for herself where she did like this great Gatsby theme type thing, type party, and everyone came out and celebrated with her. She also did this dance, guys. I mean, it was awesome. I'm going to link the full video in the link in the description down below so you guys can watch it. But this is some of the video that she did, some of the choreo that she did for her party. Yes, guys, she danced for her own party. And she also had some of her um, dolls like she had. K-Line was in the building. She did really, really great. She also had Taylor, which was her crab sister. And then she also had Micah, her other crab sister. So I really thought that was really cool for her to incorporate her doll sisters. Well, a lot of dolls really do that. I don't know if you guys ever saw Kayla's um, new video, but she also had Kaylon in her video. And then in her previous video, she also had Maya and she had a couple other dolls. So this is definitely a doll thing that other dolls do. They love to bring their sisters in and dance with them and share their moments with them. But I really like how she did this dance. It was so, so amazing. So creative. I mean, she even bought the guys out and it was doing the whole swing thing. You guys know Teneria. When Teneria does something, she is going to go all out. Like, literally. I don't know if you guys ever watched her. Like, really, really watched her. And just peep some stuff out. You're not going to know what to expect from her when she is actually doing stuff. She have had and done stuff in the past. Like her pictures, her makeup, and different stuff like that was 
very, very extra. And she's always going to give that. It's like she's going to always give like that perfect seasoning that you would put in like gumbo or some type of food. She's always that hot sauce or that special seasoning that you're going to need for your food. She's always going to be perfect with it. So the next topic for today, we're going to get into the beautiful ASU Stingettes. So you guys already know the ASU Stingettes. Y'all already know what they bring. They bring that straight fire. Don't play with them. I mean, they've been cutting up all season long. Y'all can't tell me that the Stingettes was not cutting up because y'all know they was. Period. But yeah, guys, so Stingas, they did a lot of stuff this year. If you guys watched my previous video, they did like this Aaliyah tribute. It was like this HBCU competition where the dancers had to like submit this whole video of them uh, dedicating themselves to Aaliyah, blah, blah, blah. And they really did great. I love, love, loved it. If you guys haven't checked it out, make sure you go check it out. But now they also have a freaking calendar out. Who y'all know? Well, I'm going to rephrase that. What HBCU dance team, you know, has a calendar out like with all of their dances on it. And it look really sexy, really cute. It's given everything. But I just want to share this with you guys, and I would love to know how you guys feel about this calendar that was recently just posted for the ASU thing. Gets do y'all feel like this was a great idea? Do you feel like it's too flashy? Uh, was it a bad idea? I would love to know you guys' opinions. On to the last topic, of course, the best for last, Miss Janae, Mama Janae, of course. I have done previous videos on her and her remarkable dancing. Um, if you guys haven't checked out those videos, make sure you go check it out right now. Then come back to this one. But Mama Janae posted another video of herself doing a sexy, sensual dance. And y'all know when Janae posts things and when she do certain stuff, I love to show um, and praise what she is doing because I know she came from a long way. And she's really doing her thing out here. She got her own business. She's dancing her heart out. She's beautiful. She graduated college. She's just doing all of these amazing things. And I just love to share this with you guys. So I'm going to post the video here. And I would love to know you guys' comments on how you feel about the video. So guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I would love to know you guys' opinion on everything. Do you guys feel like Tenaria did her thing with this big, extravagant, great Gatsby party? Do you feel like she could have done something more, something better? What do you guys feel about it? 
Also, I want to know how do you guys feel about the ASU thing as having the HBCU sexy sensual calendar for this year. And then lastly, I want to know how you guys feel about Janae and her dance moves and what she is doing in her life. So, yes, guys, as always, I love you guys and I can't wait to see you guys on the next video. Bye.